But yeah, in today's stream, I will be ranting and um, just generally chilling. Yeah, they should advertise the Discord more. I mean, don't they have a they have a news function in the game? Are they? I don't know. Do they have the Discord in the game? Like I might have seen it, but I don't think so. Yeah, I agree. They need some news. I mean, it's been suggested, but I know Crimson. Oh, like I remember, she said that um, she talked to the devs about having like a creator spotlight or like just like. Advertising the Discord. But, who knows? Be the Switch release, I, I'm guessing. I think it's only on Steam Shop site, yeah. It should be like in the in the menu. There should be like a, some sort of news scroller. But I'm sure they'll eventually do that. definitely excited for the switch release I think that what we need is online updates server changes and a few more quality of life things and then I think this is a 1.0 in my opinion or like what I'd consider like circuit superstars is complete and it just needs content updated with it those other things are, you know, server like uh, what is it? latency issue, latency updates, AI updates, and uh, making custom championships slash making free play basically have the menu of the custom lobbies. Those are like the three. I don't know if that's three. Can't remember main things that I would say and I would can call com, 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 blah, blah, could call could call circus superstars complete and it only needs content updates slash you know regular little bug and fixes maintenance mode I would say and any new features they want to bring of course they can always bring new features but and then the one other thing oh, nice, okay for me is making it so that we can have an hour long race. Like basically, we're even just releasing the number of laps, number of time. Just releasing that for us to do what we want with it. Even if that, even if it like, and smart, yeah. Oh, for sure. And you know, the thing is when, like luckily, they have it smooth. Cause I don't know if you remember, it was like jumpy whenever we played cross, uh, cross region, which this just definitely made like your individual experience better, which definitely was needed. Cause if you come into the game and you don't under don't know what POV is, like don't understand that part of it, which is totally fine. Don't expect everybody to notice it because it's not noticeable which is good I think I'd rather have the lag like this than you know sometimes within if you're like doing only EU people or only NA people <laughs> would have been nice to have the non POVs but yeah, I, I just think it's good that it's not noticeable for new players because or else yeah, people would just like, be like this is shit you, people already think the servers are kind of bad, which for some people they definitely are, but... Whoops. I didn't want to full go on that. So the features I mentioned, plus different tire compounds, and this would be the best game ever. Oh, oh the other thing that I want is on the settings, you should, we should be able to change the settings by 5% rather than 25%. To be honest, I don't know why they haven't done that yet. Because that's just like, that doesn't like, there can't be any bugs with that. They're already 
incrementing by 25. You just change it down, back down to five and do the multiplication. Maybe I should just be more vocal about it. Oh, that was my bit. One of my video ideas is talking about all this stuff. Maybe I'll just cut this, uh, I'll download this real quick and cut it up. Since I already said it. I mean, there's online races with fish or something. Really? There is? 139%? Like a weird percent like that? I mean, 1% would be fucking awesome if we could change it by 1%. I will have to look out for that. I have not been, I have not paid attention. I'm not a big fan of a lot of the current uh, online races. They're too short. They're just all one stops, basically. Like short one stops. Um, I refuse to do the zero stops. I'm just not gonna do it, to be honest. It's just not fun. Like I appreciate the skill of doing like a zero stop or whatever, but since that requires no racing, I'm just fed up with it. I wanna like race people, you know? And I understand strategy is racing people, but I don't know. Not really my jam. Need to be like, like 14 laps is pretty good. Just needs to be more laps per stint. That's really all I care about. I think uh, ra these races should be minimum of, unless you're on like a longer circuit like Thunder Point or whatever, like minimum of 10 laps. Cause even 10 laps, it's only, it's only five minutes. It's only a five minute race. 10 to 15, I feel like should be like, and then of course you have some of the GT races or prototype races should be like the 21. Ooh, like the 21 race, uh, Magdalena, 21 lap Magdalena Club prototype races. Oh gosh, that's so fun. Or even the 21 lap GT races. I love those. Those are probably the best, I think. Got lots of racing in and... Well, before there was only one strategy, but... I think with whatever they changed earlier. With the fuel usage, there was no fuel saving, which was nice. I guess what I'm saying is I don't think there should be any fuel saving or very like a minimal fuel saving strategy on, on these online races. Not to like bag on the devs or anything, but I do think it's kind of annoying how some some devs like they, not just, this is just general, they don't allow you all that customization when it's obviously just there and just like like in this in this case, like yeah, you can go by twenty five percent, but just like, why not just give us five percent? And I understand that they probably didn't realize, and they just haven't they haven't like thought of this really. They just didn't realize that. Maybe they did realize that the competitive community would want that stuff, something like that, or like they didn't. They probably didn't realize how. What was it called? How in obsessed the community would get. With this, with this game, so we we definitely are all obsessed. 80 stock car and storm also have 139. Ooh, interesting. Obviously possible. They just need to slightly change the code to enable it. Definitely wouldn't mind one percent. Oh, the other the other feature we need is uh, well spectator mode. I don't think that's, in my opinion, I don't think that's like absolutely essential for this for this game to be complete for me. Obviously, because not all games have that, to be honest. Um, but uh, the just the replay, replay data, as well as just the replay UI, definitely needs to happen. 
if it, for this game to be complete. Yeah, it would be amazing, for sure. And to be honest, I doubt we get that this year. Uh, I would say it's 50-50 we get it this year at this point. It's a whole new like system and like the online stuff's already pretty, you know, it's fairly bare bones, I guess. The custom lobbies was a very big, I assume pretty big implementation. Yeah, replay. Replay needs to have, I think just more camera modes. Not only more camera modes, but it should be free. Free camera. All this stuff should definitely be easily, in my opinion, should be easy po easily possible because I have looked at, I have like done some Unity dev and stuff like that. Just a little tiny bit. I've also like looked at dev logs and what like Turbo Sliders has done with one dude. That guy just let everybody do whatever the fuck they want in the game. And like that's in Unity. The replay system is just free form. It's not very buggy in my opinion. Um, it's definitely possible. I understand that's two different dev like philosophies. Definitely diff two different philosophies on the game and stuff, so. But uh, replays for sure. So I don't want to have to make my own UI, which I did for one of the, uh, the invitational last year. 